Thanks, Joe. And now I'm here with Reverends Virginia Hall and Jack Skiles. Thank you both for being here today. Thank you. There is a big benefit concert coming up for the Interfaith Winter Shelter and Shalom Center. And this is something that's kind of a celebration of milestones for the both of you. Why don't you give us a little background about, about your milestones and how you guys have collaborated together? Sure. Um, this is our 30th anniversary of our ordination, both mm -hmm. of us. And in the spring, um, I, it occurred to me that I would like to do something to celebrate. And Jack and I have been working together for a couple of years now on the Interfaith Winter Shelter. And in a casual conversation, we discovered that we were both celebrating this anniversary. Mm -hmm. So I said, well, I have an idea. How would you like to go together and have a concert? Right. And that was the beginning of this discussion. Um, the group we are invited to come is from uh, the New York area, and I heard them 25 year, uh, five years ago for mm -hmm. my 25th anniversary. Okay. I'm really excited about the possibility of them coming back. It sounds very exciting, and it's, it's a big benefit. How important is this interfaith winter shelter to our community here? Well, I'm going to turn to Jack for that. <laughs> Well, we, it's very important. We have a lot of people that are on the streets. Right. The Interfaith Winter Shelter is taking them off the streets at least through the summer months and the, and the winter months now. Mm -hmm. And for those people, it's very, very important. And this is one way for us to help fund that effort. Absolutely. And this is a November through March when it's bitter, bitter cold. That's right. Offering a shelter to lots of people. And, and it's more than just shelter. There's also, if people are in need of help, it's a good way to get them maybe the help that they need or a start. Once they're in the door, then at 7 o'clock in the morning, there's a bus that will take them back downtown or wherever they're at mm -hmm. from many of the seven different shelter sites. And that way, that gets them into Shalom Center. And there at Shalom Center, then a lot of the additional needs can be addressed. Okay. And tell us about the, the Brass Roots Trio, how you found out about them and, and what made you want to bring them to, to Bloomington. Well, um, I really found out about them sort of by accident. Mm -hmm. uh, I got an email saying they were playing in the Indianapolis area and they were looking for new sites. And at that time I was in Shelbyville. Right. And I just got in touch and I said, would you consider coming out to Shelbyville? And they said, absolutely. Okay. So they were a uh, great success, uh, wonderful personalities and music that is lively and very creative. Very creative. And what all will be going on the night of the benefit? There's well, going to be a reception at 5:30, and after the 5:30 reception, the concert starts at 6:30, and then there's another reception at 6 or at 8:30, uh, just basically giving us an opportunity to meet all the people that have been so very supportive of us and of these two efforts. Okay. Well, Virginia, Jack, thank you so much for stopping by today. We have more information, of course, on the screen as well as a as a website. And congratulations on your milestone. Well, thank, thank you. you very much. And we go back to Joe.